Hey everyone, Exonic Dan here. Welcome back to another video. So in this video, I'm going to be reviewing another product for you guys. So the product in this video that I'm going to be reviewing to you guys today is the Kashi Cocoa Seven Grain um, Seven Grain Cereal Bar. So here is the front of the box. Here is the back of the box. On this side of the box, you guys get the nutritional facts and the ingredients written in English. And on this side, it's basically the same thing, but only in French. So before we hop into what this product actually is, let's go over a little bit what is on the box itself. So, you guys, so as you guys can see, it is a new product as of the time I'm recording this video. Don't know if it's still new by the time I'm recording this video. Um, you guys can see that these are soft cereal bars made with real cocoa filling. And as we zoom in here, it says that if it will focus, it says that it is feet is oh my goodness this thing will not focus <laughs> so as you guys can see it says that it is fair trade it, is, it says fair trade whatever that means and it says cocoa i don't really know what it means but okay <laughs> um it also says that it is uh that it is a non-gmo project verified so it's verified by them it is a uh, it contains three grams of fiber and it contains 12 grams of whole grain and it says it is very small and it says that it contains 35 grams per bar. Heading over here to this side, you guys can see that it contains 175 grams. And there are five bars in the box. So, yeah, that's technically really that's really all on this, on this box itself. There's really not there's really not too much really on this box itself. Just the fact that it just says that um, it says that it contains cocoa seven grain or is this it's cocoa seven grain flavor whatever seven grain is i know what cocoa is but i have no idea what seven grain is so i guess we're about to find out what this actually tastes like because we're now going to get into what this product actually tastes like so cashy cocoa seven grain um i will say that it was definitely a very unique product um, there is definitely some flavor within this product, and I say that it would definitely be... Uh, I, it was an alright product. I wouldn't really say I'd recommend it. Like, yes, there was some cocoa in it, but to me, I just really didn't... I didn't really find myself too... too I didn't really see myself digging into this product as much as I thought I would. It was... it was decent. Not, not really too much to really write home about. Not something that I would just go out of my way and get again and again and again. But it's okay for what it is. I There's nothing really wrong with this product. It's just okay. Um, it is okay for what it is. And there's really just not too much to really... Uh, like it's, just, it's okay for what it is, but not something that I would... Gotta go out of my way and get uh, most of the times that I go to the grocery store. So yeah, it's okay. Maybe not get. I would probably not get this every single time. So overall, on a scale from one to ten, with one being absolutely horrible and ten being absolutely amazing, what do I give the Cashy Cocoa Seven Grain cereal bars on a scale from one to ten? Well, I'm gonna have to give this product right here a five out of ten. Um, it's halfway because I think that it's an okay product, it's just something that I wouldn't really get every single day, and it's just something that I wouldn't really get, um, on, you know, like, frequently at the grocery store, it's just something that I wouldn't get, like, all the time, so, um, yeah, anyways, I think with that being said, I think this is where, I think this is where, I think this is where I'm gonna end off this video, if you guys haven't enjoyed this video, please make sure to hit the like button, and also don't forget to subscribe, we get a video every single day, and also don't forget to subscribe and ring the notification bell on my second channel, my second channel will be the third link below, and if you guys would like to follow me on, and if you guys would like to follow me on Instagram or send me fan art on my Instagram, my Instagram will be the second link below, and if you guys would like to join my Roblox Finger, my Roblox Finger will be the first link below, and if you guys would like to follow me on, and if you guys would like to follow me on Twitter, my Twitter will be the fourth link below, and if you guys would like to follow me on if you guys like to follow me on Reddit, my Reddit will be the fifth link here below. And if you guys would like to follow me on TikTok, my TikTok will be the sixth link here below. And if you guys would like to check out my Facebook page, my Facebook page will be the seventh link here below. And until then, I will see you guys in the next one. Goodbye!